The sun shines over the Sussex County Courthouse as Kenneth Judkins Sr. arrives for a court hearing. His driver's license was suspended more than 20 years ago, and today he's getting it restored. Being that I didn't have a driver's license, I couldn't get a job because no one would hire me if I couldn't be able to drive to go do different things for the company. Not having a driver's license is, when they take your driver's license, it's like taking your heart from you. you you don't have anything to, to, to survive off. His case is complex due to driving violations, court fines, fees, and time. Over the 20 years, his court cases have been archived without being cleared, making it difficult to prove that he's eligible to have his driving privileges restored. He is being represented by attorney Sarah Wilson, President and CEO of Drive to Work. The nonprofit organization is an advocate for people who were previously incarcerated or have lost their driving privileges due to challenges with paying hefty court fines. Having a driver's license is so important and I hear it over and over again from our clients. What a difference it makes. When we go to court and they come out with a license, they say, you've changed my life. Drive to Work is the first of its kind in Virginia. In addition to offering countless hours of legal services, it also provides driver education classes, license test preparation, and driver improvement courses. We've been in over 90% of the localities across the state, and we see issues that arise for all types of people. We try to identify systemic issues, and what could we do to improve it? In 2019, the organization worked with the Virginia General Assembly to get a new law passed to prevent the loss of a driver's license due to non-payment of court fines or child support. As a result, more than 500,000 people had their license restored. Wilson says giving people a second chance can motivate them to do the right thing. Getting second chances is so important to people. They may have done foolish things in their younger days or even when they're older, and they know better now. And if you don't give them a second chance, they, they never improve, and it affects not only them, it affects their family and the community around them, the people that help, that have to drive them places. It's the best thing that happened to me in quite a, a long time. And I'm gonna do everything in my power to, to keep them this time. This is a second chance for me.